Hey friends, welcome to another video of What About From Thrive this month. So this is my September... So this is my Thrive box for the month of September 2022. Uh, usual, my usual stuff and I got a couple new things. Okay, so kind of starting over here with like the paper stuff, I guess. I really like this brand of toilet paper. I've been using this for a while and it is made from bamboo. So I got a restock of that. I get that every month. I also get this every month. Rosie is the brand by Thrive. This is their dishwasher packets. They have lemon and original scent. I honestly can't smell the difference. And then back here, I always get two things of tissues. Those are also bamboo. I also, we had a party a couple weeks ago and we used this brand of compostable utensils and they worked perfectly. I have an insane amount amount of spoons, no forks. We don't have any party on the near future horizon, but I just wanted to get these so I didn't forget. So now I'm good on forks. I have not purchased woolly balls in like a decade and I got a freebie last time and realized how bad mine actually were. So the new ones are hard like tennis balls. Mine were like super squishy. So I bought another pack of dryer balls. This is a three pack. These are natural. The one I got before was um, lavender scented and it's a little intense. This one is not. You know how we buddy? All right, don't touch anything yet, okay? I know, so hold on, I'll go through them. This right here is my freebie for this box. It's these, I probably wouldn't have purchased this myself. I'm guessing this is like emergency. It looks like immune support drink mix. I did purchase a bunch of like cold season getting ready stuff. So this was all from Flavor City Bobby approved things. So this right here is Cold Crush. I used to get Cold Calm and he recommended this one. I'll link the video if I can find it. It might have been a short. This was this brand of honey. I can never remember how you say that, but that's supposed to be very good for you. Matt liked cough drops. I'm like meh about them. So I got these ready. Nobody's sick by the way, just in case. I did and was very excited about this product. So this is what Bobby was talking about and it has in it this bee propolis extract. I'm probably saying that horribly wrong. And it's supposedly very good homeopathic for the second you start feeling sick to spray this down your throat. So that's why I got that to have on hand. I also recently just beefed up my vitamins. So this brand Garden of Life, I got their vitamin C because it's not synthetic. And then combination with the zinc, vitamin D, I think is the other one he recommended as like the holy trinity of when you're feeling like you're gonna get sick. This just happened to be a buy two, so I had to get two of them, but that's okay. So I have two of these. So then over here as just a restock, I have some diced tomatoes, those go in the basement. And then Rayos was on sale, so I got the tomato basil, tomato basil and the marinara. This is a restock of just coconut aminos. Then I got some more hemp seeds. We use these for, gosh, pumpkins, muffins, pumpkins, oh my God, pancakes, muffins, and mostly smoothies. This is a great source of protein, especially for a little toddler that doesn't like to eat food, but will eat smoothies for me. I didn't have any peanuts, so I bought peanut butter for the first time in forever from Costco, but I make my own peanuts. I just throw this entire thing in the Vitamix, that's it, and then just blend, 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 and you get peanut butter, it's amazing. So I needed to restock with this. Another restock is, I like their cocoa powder, so I got this, it's ethically source direct from farmers organic all sorts of good stuff so just regular cocoa powder for you know whatever baking it's gonna be holiday baking soon these primal kitchen has a bunch of new stuff including some dips we got the queso the last time and I think I guess it was just mild so this is a spicy one I do not eat this this is all Matt I got this for Matt and then I got a restock I like to have this for lunchtime this is just wild caught albacore tuna and it's canned in water there's four packs in here so I got that these are always a restock for lunches these are just the original pitted olives and then these are zesty Italian Matt takes us to work let me tip you down a little bit here so I got some two spices this time I got some black peppercorns for my pepper grinder and then I got a restock of cinnamon. This is the one we go through the, the most. I wish they had a bigger pouch. This is 2.24 ounces. I wish they had like a bulk size of this from Thrive because um, we go through cinnamon so fast. I'm a cinnamonaholic and I put it in tons of stuff. Then I got, now that's getting cooler, they can ship these to me without a cold pack. I'm just trying to cut back on packaging so I don't order chocolate in the summer. These are pretty much for chocolate chip cookies. I take these and break them up or other recipes. I'd love to say that I eat these but I really try not to. So these are for holiday baking essentially. And then I really like this brand, Tony's. I saw them in a documentary. Did they talk about their product here? They basically talked about how they do, like this is the most fair trade chocolate that you can buy. So 
I like them. I bought this, I was like, ooh, dark chocolate, and then realized later, <laughs> I did this last year too. It's dark chocolate candy cane. I did not see the candy cane part when I bought it, but you know, whatever. We'll munch on it through the holidays. I thought it was just regular dark chocolate, so I was gonna melt it and put almond bits in it and stuff, so oops, my fault for not reading. But anyway, it's a great brand of chocolate. I like them a lot. These are just a restock, but we still have a lot from the last time. These Looney Prunes, I just got one bag this time. I actually do not use a lot of cane sugar anymore. I'm so happy to finally be able to announce that, but I just needed a little bit, so I got this bag and it is just 16 ounces or a pound. So here's the new stuff I've never tried before. I would love it if Paul ate seaweed and I don't wanna buy the massive thing of Costco. So this I thought was a great thing to try. So we are gonna see if Paul likes seaweed. Seaweed has tons of vitamins. Actually has proteins, shockingly. So it just has to tear off and give to, you know, all sorts of different things you can eat it with. So I'm gonna see if Paul enjoys this. I also have never seen this before. I figured this would make Matt happy. This is primarily for salads. So this is basically bacon bits healthier bacon bits. So I got that. And then this brand, I got the Puffs for Paul. They also had these chickpea snacks, which I've had chickpea snacks before. It's basically just toast chickpeas till they're crunchy. And I'm gonna see if Paul will eat this because it is five grams of protein. Also, when you buy Thrive, you also get the cardboard packaging, which apparently your toddler loves to throw around the house. Did you have fun, buddy? It's so goofy. What do you think? Oh my goodness. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you like videos like this, give it a thumbs up. Leave me some comments below if you have anything to add, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.